everyone, this is Jason Lupke, Global Solution Specialist with Houghton Mifflin Harcourt. And I want to talk today about how you as a student can navigate through your course on the Global Learning Platform. Let's get started. So I'm looking right now at my student view of the Global Learning Platform, and I'm in a third grade reading class. But just know that these basic steps will be the same no matter what grade level or what class you're in inside of the GLP. So as a student, the things that I see, I have my table of contents over here on the left-hand side. I have my content screen here in the middle. Across the bottom, I have two options. I have Explore. And when I'm in Explore, that's when I'm navigating through my table of contents and I can see my content here in this screen. And then of course I've got my assignments tab and that will list all of my assignments that my teacher has given me. You'll notice across the top, I've got the title of my course. So this will be whatever my teacher has called the course. That's what will be listed up here. As I move to the right, all of the content in the GLP is searchable. So I have a search bar up here. Notifications will show up in this area. All of my grades will show up in this grade book tab. This will take me back to my list of all of my courses. And then here's my profile information. Now, you'll notice as we get into one of these modules and I go to any page inside of that module, I have some more options that show up here. If my teacher has given this to me as an assignment, instructions will show up here. My, my assignment, I know it's an assignment if that is lit up blue like it is here. When I'm finished with an assignment, I'll check this box and so this green done sign will come up here. And I'm able to let my teacher know how I feel about the assignment by using the emoji pop-up window. So I can give it any kind of emoji that I would like, okay? And all of that is right up here. Now, of course, I can also navigate through the pages of this, just like I would a textbook, by clicking my right and left arrows down here. So this has been how a navigation overview from a student's perspective. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.